I shall demonstrate how to pass data to a view from a controller and display it on the browser. Create a usual MVC app and add a home controller to it, as shown here. This file is the home controller with an action method called index. This is what has to be done, load an object with data inside the controller and pass it to the view. You are allowed to send only one object, so everything must packed into a single object. We can pack virtually any amount of data into one object by a proper design of the class. The class could have a few primitive properties or more complex UDTs or IE numerables. First create a controller and an action method to it. This one should be familiar to you. Then attach a view to it, so that it knows which view it is paired to. Find an empty space inside the method block and right click to add a view. Then create a data object. And pass it to the view. Now I'll show the steps one by one. First create a class to hold your data. Simpler classes can be put in models folder. Developers place more complex ones in a folder called view models. Right click to add a class. Give it a name. Add public properties. This is the file we are working in. Now we'll add a view by right clicking here, MVC will automatically pair it with the action method. It shows a number of options, I recommend ignoring them, it's better to do things manually. These options don't help in more complex scenarios. So let the defaults stay, click add. You should see this HTML-like file. Let me show you its location. We have to specify the data type of the object that will reach this page. Start typing from the very first line. The wizard would have done it for you. Full path is required, start by typing the name of your project and dots will guide you. This is lowercase model, there is another one with the same name but with M. Type. Must be the first line, no semicolon. Let's write an inlined HTML.
this is Razor character to mark the start of C sharp code. The Razor engine deduces the end from context. Uppercase model. Compare with this, its lowercase model. No semicolons required. Let's create an object here. Namespace needs to be added. Set the properties one by one. Pass the object to the view. Build the project. And launch it. This is the output. Thank you.